that was a really close set. Um, good play to Cody, but he did really well. It's sad to see him get bested like that, but. Oh my God. <laughs> so here's what just happened. SNS just clicked the random button and he picked Pichu. I just want you to know what just happened. That's oh all. Oh my God. He clicked the random button and they're going to Battlefield and well, SNS is Pichu. I don't know if you saw it. Uh, SNS beat Mr. U with Kirby. What? Are you uh, kidding? He he told him he was gonna go Kirby, and it was game three, and uh, he beat he beat it, he beat Mr. U's Sheik with Kirby, which that matchup is garbage, as far as I know. Oh! Oh my God! <laughs> please! Oh! What? <laughs> so what? earlier earlier I was there talking about uh, SNS, and uh, you know I, I told everyone you know number one on the PR for those of you who don't know number one on the PR really solid player been playing for a long time known for his Luigi and his Marth. Um, but also for a while, and this is before my time, like I said. But apparently, he used to ran uh, he used to secondary the random button, and I guess he's bringing back uh, that that whole system tonight. So, well, I'm completely okay with this. Um, it's not every day you get to see Pichu versus Falco on stream. Ooh. Oh my god! But that was sick for an envelope here. Well, it's also against Pichu, so it's it's true. <laughs> but I mean, it, it was still a sick combo. Like shine all the way up to up up air. Oh sick. my oh. gosh. So, um, Pichu, uh, let's at least try and discuss this character All right, and so see what we can do. Uh, the big problem with Pichu, um, one of the big problems at least, is um, huge lack of, oh my god, is huge lack of disjointed moves. It's Pichu, true. Um, like, P um, Pikachu has this problem as well, but Pichu is even smaller, so it makes it really, really hard to take on characters like, say, Marth. Right, absolutely. And another big problem with Pichu is that you do damage yourself with a lot of your moves. Uh, that was, that, that's kind of the kind of the, the, the big punishment, but at the same time, your moves aren't any better, so it's not like mm -hmm. it's really rewarding you for anything. Um, your ups, uh, Pichu's up smash is still amazing. Mm -hmm. Also, up air is really, really good as well for popping people up. Up air is really good. It's got some really good fixed knockback. Um, your recovery is still pretty good, similar to Pichu's, um, but you do hurt yourself with it. So actually, you're kind of building up these percentages as you go with a lot of your moves, any of your moves that use the lightning effect or uh, your up B, down B if you, if you hit yourself, but not otherwise, but like, you still yeah. got forward tilt, though. You still have forward tilt. Oh, we let him back. All but right. Cody doesn't care. Or I think, I think he, Envelope, rather. I, I think he gave him that one. He was like, no, you had that one. I don't know. It, it looked like he gave it to him. Might have been a jump. There's no side. reason to do a, a drop down reverse side B. Like, doesn't make sense. But, but um, Pikachu is a very strange character. Very small, so it can be awkward to hit for Falco's lasers. So if you're not familiar with the matchup, then it can be pretty awkward to get around. Like, look, almost all these lasers are just going right over Pikachu, um, Pichu's head. It's true. That's true, and there's there's the up air we we're talking about. It's gonna be covering some options. Oh, he went for something swag. Now what's really cool about Thunder, um, Pikachu is true as well. I mean, Pichu is the only one that gets damage. But if you hit a platform instead of yourself, you actually don't take damage for it. Yeah, you can also uh, if you do it while you're moving, it'll land behind you, uh, and you won't take damage that way. Yep. Either. So as long as you're not getting hit by the electricity, then you're exactly, damage for exactly. It. But moves like a uh, back air don't cause you damage, uh, but forward air does. Yep. Uh, down air does, as far as I know. Um, um, down air definitely does. Nair doesn't. Though. Nair doesn't, and there's is really solid. Oh, uh, forward tilt's down the wrong way. None of your tilts cause damage to you either. Ooh, but that was that was mean. That uh, just sounded mean. Like it was like thick hits, and then this Pikachu just. Choo! Or Pichu just. Choo, just choo. As he's just getting murdered. But uh, SNS in the lead here, trying to power shield some of these lasers. Cody getting better about using back. super low. All right. lasers, but then gets an airplane. And he just jump news. I wonder if we're gonna see another Pichu, or if he's just gonna random again. He might. He might random. Again. I would love to see another random. He's gonna do it. But we gotta, we gotta pick a stage first. And then just get Marth. <laughs> we gotta pick a stage first. Oh, we're just running it back. Okay. All right. What do we got? Pichu versus Falco again. All right. On Yoshi's story, which is, I think it's a better stage, but it also gives Pichu. I mean, Pichu's not really gonna be getting too many up smash yeah. kills on the stage, probably. Pichu but. dies or super early, and it's gonna be exaggerated on Yoshi's. Um, but Pichu's also not gonna be able to use um, as amazing of a recovery as Pichu has. Like, not be able to use it to the fullest extent. So I, I would definitely say this is a pretty solid counter pick for Envelope here. Yeah, this is this is a really good stage for um, for uh, for Falco. Sorry, I was distracted by the Pichu stuff. But uh, really good stage for Falco here. Um, but it's. We'll see if it works out, you know. Who knows how to fight against Pichu, right? Like, I don't know how to fight against Pichu. You think, oh, you Randall think it'd be, that was very nice, but you think it'd be free, but Pichu has enough weirdness that can really, really destroy you. It's it's kind of the same thing I talked about during uh, the match that he, that uh, SNS played Kirby. It's that, yeah, they're garbage characters. As Pichu and Kirby are the two worst characters in the game by the, by the official tier list, um, and that's just professional opinion. But, like, um... No, like uh, they still have attacks. They still they, they, they still have moves, and they they have enough jank to them 
that uh, if you don't, if you've never seen the character play at high level, you might get hit by some stuff that you don't expect, and it only is going to take a few hits for you to lose a stock, right? Like, yep. And also, those characters are typically like both of them are pretty small. Pichu oh, especially. Oh, oh my no, gosh! No. Oh. That was a 69 damage combo. Oh, my, it's still going. All Just right. another punish. Oh, oh that tech though. That tech though. Oh my sick. gosh. Envelope's so clean. Yeah, um, you can oh. SDI um, Pichu's forward smash pretty hard. It's a ton of hits that just give you a ton of room to SDI. Yeah, that, that, was, was, nice. that was very clean. Dying at 86 to up air. Yeah, it's Pichu. Pichu, one of the lightest characters in the game, which is another reason <laughs> that uh, that building up damage on yourself is a bad thing. Like it, it's you put if it was like a heavier so character, early. it's not as big of a deal. But since you die so early, getting hit by doing damage to yourself just builds that up, and you die immediately. You took three damage from recovering there. I mean, and that three damage could be the difference between winning and losing a stock. Like it, it could get you killed, or it could not. Oh, didn't get the double jump up air. Oh, but a nice reverse back air just to set him off stage. It was weak, but it, it got him the stage position. But yeah, going back to the um, uh -oh. low and mid-tier discussion, um, those characters still can hurt you. I mean, look at DJ Nintendo's Bowser. If right. you don't know how to play that matchup and actually take advantage of, you know, what your character, like, does well in it, then you can easily get destroyed. Exactly. And uh, characters like uh, like Donkey Kong. We see Green Ranger wrecking with him. We see, you know, I, I play a decent DK. I'm not nowhere near anyone like Green Ranger's level, but... Um, like, I, I win some matchups because people don't know how to fight against DK. Yep, and you get way more experience with the popular characters than people do um, yeah, every, vice versa. Everybody knows how to play against the Spacey, everyone knows how to play against Marth, Falcon, etc. Because everyone plays those characters because they're the high tiers. They're the characters you're going to see the most com like competitive success with because they're the best characters in the game. Uh, and so you'll you'll see those matchups all the time. You don't really hardly ever see a Pichu. The only time you see it is when M2K is trolling, or uh, someone random random shows up in like wave one of bracket. Yeah. You know, like or wave one of pools, and uh, you never know what's gonna happen. Oh! Oh my God! Oh. I was kind of expecting the up air there, but yeah, it's I was not. Expecting it the doesn't have. A, there's no spike like with Pikachu. Oh, so. it's in straight up. That's right. Yeah. Um, it's um, what it's like is um, the first part of Pikachu's up air that actually sends straight up. Oh! Oh my, oh my God! That read. It is dead even percent, 73 to 73, but oh Pichu's off stage. Ooh, not quite connecting Come with that. Uh-oh, that's, don't get that's, that's a trade you Pichu. don't want. Oh my god! <laughs> and Envelope's not happy about that one. Mm -mm. I can completely understand that. Envelope's not happy about that Ooh. one at all. 